Hello everyone and welcome to this new video. Today we're going to prepare our new lineup of course because we're about to play a new game. So we're about to play against I Peggio. They are here. They have been scoring quite a decent amount of goals, but they have been conceding way less than we did, which is possibly which is quite possibly possibly not a very difficult task, I'd rather say. But uh, yeah, let's see what uh, what's what, and let's see. Well, let's have a look at their lineup. So there they are. Right, they have very high skills apparently. Midfield and strikers are very good apparently. Let's have a look at all of them. Goalkeeper four star sixty seven point two, so not particularly skilled. Yet um, very very experienced, so dangerous for us. Four stars twenty six point nine, four stars five point nine, four stars thirteen point eight. But he's playing out of his role, isn't he? Yes, he is. Well, there's probably a different defender there. Then uh, four and a half star. Well, disqualified, which is very good for us actually. And then four and a half stars, twenty three point three. Four and a half stars, thirty one point nine. Four and a half stars, forty seven point seven. Uh, four stars, five point two. So on the wings, we are stronger. Mm, quite possibly not at the centre. Then forty seven point two with four and a half stars. Very dangerous player, this one. And then four stars, twenty six point two. And these guys have very high finishing skills, so they're very, very, very dangerous. On top of that, uh, this one guy is going to uh, lend some experience over to this guy, uh, which is very bad. Let's have a look at the heading skills, because I have the impression that this might be the weak point. And if it is, we're good. Actually, Napoli is way stronger than this one guy when it comes to heading skills. Let's have a look if they have any uh, very good uh, central defenders. I'm sorry, guys, but uh, this computer is still very weak. It has not improved over these months. So it's got to be slow. Well, they have actually good defenders. One's injured. Uh, one is quite possibly back. This one, uh, like Abdul Mohamed guy. Yes, this one guy is good. And then Battaglia is very good, actually. Uh, this one guy is the one who was disqualified. So these two are possibly going to play at the center of the defense which is no good news but the defending wingers did not look all too strong and they don't seem to have any uh, left defender over there so this is good for us so let's try and see uh, what well, let's try and do what I anticipated on Monday uh, let's switch these two. So, Vario here. Cherian is going to play uh, in the last few minutes. Let's try and see if Vario's higher defending skills will pay off, in particular against uh, very good strikers like the ones we'll see uh, during this match. And then Hildecek is back, so let's put him into the right spots. And there we go. I'm not very happy with Fernando not playing. Uh, well, I actually forgot to demote Vario, which means he's available for this game. Um, that's why you see him here. We could actually play Fernando for him here as a winger. This is quite risky. No, we cannot because we're 
we already have to play Ceriani Costa and Troiano so I think we're better off like this actually because those two strikers are very dangerous so we cannot afford to have them playing around messing around with our midfield um, and then let's play on the wings and I'd say they're attacking on the wings both both wings because we have to keep the opponents from getting the ball with their strikers that's the only hope we have and uh, that's the only option we have in my opinion it's going to be a very uh, tough game if the uh, and if the uh, the engine uh, I'm sorry, the match engine is fair. We stand very low chances. We stand very low chances to win. Very low, low chances. So, let's do something like that. So, Veniero replaced by Ciriani. Given that Veniero has the tendency to get too many yellow cards. And then, let's swap these two. So, a Costa and Brianza as a central midfielder, and there we go. And hopefully, we'll get some points this time around. Well, in case we're winning, which is very unlikely, we'll go attacking and try to defend a bit more. Let's see how things pan out there. I'm I'm not that confident that uh, this game will be satisfying but we have to try that we definitely have to try that so guys I think uh, that was it for today's uh, video thanks a lot again for watching support the team because we definitely need that now we definitely have to find the winning lineup we do have the players to win in my opinion but there is something that is still out of control and I don't and I still don't understand what exactly. Hopefully this video will, will, uh, move will change things, uh, will turn things around at least a little bit. Not quite confident about this, but hope will never die. So thanks a lot again for watching guys and see you in the next video. Bye.